Hey guys, me Poppy Rain here. Now I look like shit. But I just woke up from 10 o'clock. And my goal was to get all the laundry done by 11 or by 9 o'clock tonight. So that gives me exactly 11 hours to get all the laundry done. Which realistically, I don't know if that's going to happen. But I'm going to start by pushing over the load I did yesterday. So I've got a load in the dryer, a load in the washer. It means I'd have to do about a load an hour in order to get it all done. I did just bring down laundry, daddy's dirty socks from yesterday, laundry, a couple things that I missed yesterday, a couple things of mine that were dirty. So after this, I'm going to go eat so I can take meds. Then I'm just going to go slowly through the house. And I'll do like a video. Every hour I'll come down here and check laundry. Because the dryer takes about 75 minutes. The washer takes about half hour, 45 minutes, I think. I'm not exactly sure. Basically, what I'll do is I'll set a timer. Like every hour, I'll come down here. And I'll just go through the house. And do one thing in each room and rotate. I'm going to skip the bathroom because the bathroom has the least amount of stuff to do. But I feel like it's some of the most work. Because it's got the least amount of stuff. So I'm not doing any of the deep cleaning yet. Just doing all the organizing, picking up stuff. So, like, for example, I'll do the kitchen. I'll do, like, the fridge. Cleaning and organizing the fridge. And then I'll do, like, taking ten things off the dining room table. Then I'll work on getting ten things off the couch. Then I'll work on... Putting X amount of stuff away in the boys' room. You know, that kind of stuff. I'll come down here and I'll bag up garbage. I'll come down here and I'll get a pile of stuff. You know, whatever the case may be. So I just put in those two dryer sheets. But I think every time I come down here, I'll work down here for about a half hour or so. So basically what I'll do is, I'll do work in the house. I'll come down here, I'll throw in laundry, I'll work for a half hour. Then I'll go upstairs and do a task. Because there's so much that needs to be done. Like in the kitchen, the stove needs to be cleaned. The floor needs to be swept. The floor needs to be mopped. The floor needs to be picked up. The counter needs to be cleaned. Dishes need to be done. The fridge needs to be... 
emptied and sorted. Those are the seven big things I can think of in the lawn, in the kitchen. In the, lit, in the dining room, dining room table has to be cleaned off, has to be cleaned up all around the dining room. All the laundry has to be put away. The dining room has to be steam cleaned, vacuumed. Daddy stuff has to be fixed. In the living room, it has to be steam cleaned, vacuumed. The whole TV stand needs to be cleaned off and redone. I need to redo Gabe's setup. I need to build the shelf and put that away and put all the shoes away, the shoe rack. I have to clean off the couch. I have to clean behind the couch. The stairs need to be vacuumed, steam cleaned, and there's a spot that needs to be re-glued. The hallway needs to be vacuumed and steam cleaned. The litter box could probably be changed. The boys' room needs to be vacuumed. Possibly, there's a couple spots that need to be steam cleaned. All the rest of their stuff needs to be put away. The bathroom, the toilet needs to be scrubbed. The floor needs to be swept and mopped. You need to put the new mat down. The sink needs to be scrubbed again. Any odds and ends needs to be put away. There's one, like a few random things here and there. The shower needs to be scrubbed. In our room, Remy's cage needs to be teared apart. The walls need to be cleaned. The door needs to be cleaned. The floors need to be vacuumed and steam cleaned. Everything needs to be picked up. The bassinet needs to be emptied and brought down here. The bedding needs to be washed. There's a lot that needs to be done. Um, if I worked nonstop all day and filmed each section, I'd probably have about, probably have the rest of 2023 filmed, or tw sorry, 2024, the rest of 2024 filmed. I found this on the web. And I'd never get to sit down. And I still wouldn't get it all done today. There's realistically... Probably about 48 hours to 72 hours worth of work to do. I might honestly take breakfast to go. So that way I can get work on Gabe's room. So that way hopefully by the time Daddy leaves, Gabe will go down for a nap. So that way Gabe will sleep the whole time Daddy's gone. And I can get lots of work done. That's what I'm ultimately hoping. Like, it's not that I don't love my child. It's that I want to get mountains of work done. Okay. So as you guys can see, we still have another like 20 loads of laundry to do. Legitimately still have like 20 loads. Because as I mentioned before, I'm still washing clothes that my sister-in-law 
gave me back in like November for the kids from the kids um this clothes some of this is my clothes some of this is clothes I found in the closet when I was cleaning that I didn't know had stains on them that need to be stain treated but I'm not very good about going through clothes Treating them. Stay true right now. I'm keeping dressed because that's what I have. So I got it from the baby shower. Works pretty good. And that also makes this process take longer if I have to sit here and stain treat crap. Some of these clothes are mine that I just recently wore. Some of these clothes are clothes I just recently thrifted. Some of these clothes were clothes I got for free. Some of this stuff is laundry that just hasn't been washed yet. bedding and whatnot. Bob Marley shirt that I just put in there that I literally got maybe I think me and Kelsey got back in like November or January literally most of these socks most of these little kid socks one my sister in law gave me for my nephews baby that needs major help. I'm going to get her clean. Because she's pretty gross. get it clean I'm gonna have to donate her I got that baby probably two months ago never have underwear because they're always in the freaking laundry know where these underwear came from. They might have come from my nephews. I know this I just bought yesterday for Gabe. Because he's obsessed with Baby Shark. This thing is dirty as hell. I know I just thrifted yesterday. This I just thrifted yesterday. Those clothes, I don't even know. I don't even remember this dress, but sure.
I don't even remember some of these clothes. Okay, that's all the clothes I've got for in here. Hey Siri, set a timer for 11 o'clock. I'll be back down here at 11 to do my next load of laundry. So I have until 11 to eat breakfast. And possibly work on the dining room. Well, I want to check to see if this stuff's dry yet. This stuff's mostly dry. I'm gonna go take the stuff upstairs and offer it up to my Gaby Gabe. See if he wants it. It's a couple baby toys and a um, thing. I got them for free. So we're gonna go offer these up to Gabe, go eat some breakfast. And like I said, hopefully Gabe will sleep most of the time daddy's gone. That way I can just work on getting housework done. Got a pile of boxes that need to go. Daddy's goal for tonight is dishes. And I'm going to try and find his things that I can set up his, so that we can set up the thing. Actually, I might go work on the room. But I'm going to go and I'll catch you guys on the flip side. Bye, guys.